Hurricane Hillary strengthens to a Category 4 storm, but is expected to weaken before bringing rain to the southwest United States this weekend. Concerns are escalating as Hurricane Hillary, a Category 4 storm, is predicted to bring unprecedented rainfall and potential flooding to southwest United States and parts of California, beginning Sunday and extending into next week. The hurricane could deposit over a year's worth of rain in parts of California, Nevada, and Arizona. For the first time, a level 4 of 4 risk for excessive rainfall has been declared for parts of Southern California. This major storm, which strengthened from a tropical storm to a Category 4 hurricane within 24 hours, is currently situated approximately 360 miles south of Cabo San Lucas, Mexico, with sustained winds of 145 mph. The hurricane is expected to stay at Category 4 as it approaches Mexico's Baja California Peninsula. While the hurricane is more likely to make landfall in Mexico and cross into California, if it makes landfall in California as a tropical storm, it would be the first such occurrence in nearly 84 years. The first ever tropical storm watch has been issued for parts of Southern California. Despite the expectation that Hillary will weaken significantly before reaching Southern California and parts of the Southwest, the storm will still greatly increase rainfall and the risk of flooding. The most intense downpours are expected on Sunday and Monday. Southern parts of California and Nevada could see 3 to 5 inches of rain with isolated amounts of up to 10 inches. Central parts of these states, as well as western Arizona and southwest Utah, could receive 1 to 3 inches of rain. Notably, Death Valley, California, the hottest place on Earth, could receive 1 to 2 years worth of rainfall in one day. Prolonged rain could oversaturate the ground and overwhelm waterways, intensifying the flood threat. Weekend flood watches have been issued across Southern California from San Diego to Los Angeles. The National Weather Service in Los Angeles has also warned of the potential for dangerously high surf, rip currents, and coastal flooding. Meanwhile, the Atlantic is also bracing for an increase in tropical activity with four separate areas of concern stretching from west of the Cabo Verde Islands to the Gulf of Mexico. Thanks for staying with us till the end of this update. If you found our coverage on Hurricane Hillary's potential impact on Southwest United States and California informative, please give this video a thumbs up. Your support enables us to continue providing you with crucial weather updates. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell to never miss out on our future news summaries. Stay safe and see you in the next video.